Hey everybody, this is Scott with Pest Plus. So I want to I want to make an educational video for you. We're in New Jersey, somewhere in New Jersey, and we're doing a heat job in a two-family house. When we came into the house, we initially found uh, bed bugs upstairs where the owners live. Uh, they threw out their bed in the meantime. Uh, I brought in a K-19. The K-19 alerted to their bedroom, their den, and the living room. Also, we came downstairs to the tenant's unit, and uh, it was unbelievable. We found load and load and load with bed bugs in the uh, son's bedroom. So, we gave him two options. One was the chemical over a series of time. The other one was heat. Uh, the woman was interested in saving her couch. It was a fairly new couch. It was expensive. We told her the heat would be able to do this, as we've done hundreds of heat jobs. So, today we're doing the heat. And uh, we have actually two generators here. They're 96 kW. We're hosting about uh, 18 to 20 heaters inside with fans. It's about 145 degrees inside. It's extremely hot right now. And the reason why we got to get it that hot is because we want to eliminate the bed bugs from just one treatment. And we can do that with heat. It's the only procedure that allows that to happen. But we have to kind of cook the house, we have to turn it into a big dryer, and uh, we have to make it very hot, which we're gonna go inside, it's gonna get very hot for me, and uh, my voice is gonna probably change, you're gonna see me sweating a lot, but I'll take you through the rooms, and what you're gonna see is you're gonna see the heaters we use, and you're gonna see the fans. The fans are what's circulating the heat all around the rooms. What's great about the heat is the heat is gonna penetrate the carpets, the wood furniture, the headboards, going to uh, penetrate the couches, it's going to penetrate the closets. So literally, there's hardly any prep to do, <clears throat> which for working people, it's a plus 10 times over. Uh, also, we didn't have to clear out any of the dresser drawers. We have gauges inside there, and which allows us to monitor. So what we also do is we take a reading every half hour to determine are we hot enough do we need to reposition the fans or the heaters, or do we need to turn it down a little bit? So we initially came in here. We did a quick perimeter uh, chemical application, and then we're using the heat, and then we'll finish up with some more chemical. And approximately 10 to 12 days, we'll bring the K-19 back in the area, independent K-19. They will go through the house, and look, we're very legit economy. If they're going to alert, we're going to fix it. And if everything is good, then everything is good. So the homeowners wanted the best. They found us uh, online, which you can find at us if you're local in New Jersey at www.pestplus.net or if you're throughout the country in the state and you're watching this, you can go on my other website, which is www.getmyfreebedbugreport.com. That's getmyfreebedbugreport.com and you can get all the information you need. You can also purchase my book. So let's take a walk. We won't be in there too long again because it's very hot, but you'll get the general idea of what I'm talking about. Come on. Curry and Neil. Curry is basically done you know my face. all the heat jobs. Curry used to be a white guy. And now I'm black. Now he's black. And it's no fault of mine, it's fault of all the heat jobs he did. So he cooked them like a big toaster. Haven't failed yet, though. Haven't failed yet. Alright, let's go. Alright, starting to get really hot. You know, see it, but my glasses are fogging up. We're gonna go in the downstairs apartment first. This was the one again in the kids' bedroom, which I pointed out. Even the knobs are really hot. Come on in. It's gonna get a little loud, but we'll show you. I'll point a lot, you'll get the idea. See what we have here? We actually have the couches turned upside down. And my guys will come in and flip it every hour. We have pictures that are still left on the wall. As you can see, they're not breaking. You can touch it. We do have to worry about some stuff, but we are coming in here admiring. The closet right here is getting cooked. We have a fan going into the closet, which is heating that up. As you can see, the beds are actually made into a teepee to allow the heat to circulate. The drawers are all open. Man, is it hot here. The drawers are all open here. 
Now we're able to save that new bed. Besides cooking their bed, we're also going to put protective bed mattress covers on both the box spring and the bed when we're done. But that'll be at the end of the day, okay? This room initially was the worst. So they also had a lot of stuff under that bed. We had them clear. The beds and the box spring, actually the box springs were loaded with bed bugs. Okay? So the headboards are getting cooked. The only thing we have to worry about sometimes when we're doing heat is wallpaper can fall down. Anything that's glued can have a tendency to melt. Uh, we have to watch the window shades. They seem to be okay. As you can see, the closets are open. Even the things that are in bags, the heat is going to penetrate. Okay, this, this insulation panel is here because it's the kitchen. We'll do this last. We'll take it off for a little while. And plus then we'll do the bathroom last. We don't need that much time. And then here, here in the girls' room, you can see the same type of thing. We have the heat circulating around. We have the beds. The heat is circulating with the fans. Okay, it's able to penetrate all this. Even the wood is extremely hot. So the, the purpose of this is to also kill the eggs, right? So chemical is not going to kill the eggs. Chemical is going to kill the bed bugs, but the eggs are going to emerge possibly in 30 days later. Heat is the only thing that's going to kill it. We do use crinite on occasion. You can't freeze a whole house like this. You can only heat a house like this. Most pest control companies, what I have found, either give false information about crinite or really don't know how to use it correctly so then they don't get really the end result and then people are unhappy about it. It's, it's, you got to find out the right information, okay? Let's take a walk. All these books are getting cooked. They're very, very hot. If there were bed bugs in these books, we wouldn't have to worry. It would kill the eggs in the bed bugs. Actually, if you can see right here, you see right here a little bit, just a little bit. I don't know if we did that or not, but you can see the glue is a little bit loose, you know, so we'll have to pay attention to that. Oh man, I just brought my freaking leg. Watch that side. Yeah, it's very hot. Do you need booties? What? Huh? Booties. No. So we're coming up here. All the doors are closed. It's gonna. It is an oven in here. Okay. Dog did alert to the couch, and she was very concerned. As you see. We have the couch flipped over. We're baking it. We'll, we'll move the uh, covers. Like it's getting hard to talk, like I told you. Okay, we have all the glass in here. Again, this room, they had the bed bugs. They threw out the mattress and box spring. We get a lot of problems with headboards that are wood and footboards when we use chemical. It's a pain in the neck. However, with the heat, we, we do great penetration and we're over and done. So this is what we got going on here. Okay? Everything is working. You see the lights are on, the closet doors are open. And then again in here, I can't even walk in here. It's just way, way, way too hot. It's uh, beyond an oven. In here, it's all getting baked. People can leave their TVs in. Their computers here. Their electronics, everything is going to be fine as long as everything is unplugged and turned off. We have a small room in here that's baking. Come on, let's go. We have a small room in here that's baking. Okay? And again, we have to watch the windows, we have to watch everything. You know, sometimes the neighbors come out, they want to know what's going on, and we basically tell them, look, we're just supplying power, they got to talk to the homeowners, we're not going to share any information, this is confidential. And so that's it. So listen, if you have a big problem, you know, and you need it solved right away, then I would recommend to go with the heat. There is a definitely different price points 
for different things and he is the most expensive. You are going to pay top dollar, I am going to tell you, but it's going to be well worth it because your problem is going to be solved. I can't bring 100, today we have $200,000 worth of equipment coming to your house. I got to be honest with you, you know, we're in, you know, we're in to solve a problem and we're also for profitability, all right? So we spent buku bucks to get this type of power, to get this type of work going on and we want to help you and we want to make it work and we can make it work. So listen, until next time, I'm Scott and I'm about to drop dead because it's so hot in here, you can see me sweating. Listen, get on my website at www.getmyfreebedbugreport.com or again, if you're in Central New Jersey area, check us out at pestplus.net. Listen, we'll catch you next time. I got to get the hell out of here. Bye.